Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, we've got some development today on Windows 11 thanks to a leak of some of the code that is inside the leak. So the code of course has information about dates and uh, seems to say that the next version of Windows 11 is about a month away from being complete. That means that after that, it'll be pushed to insiders for testing before the release, of course, on the second half of 2022. So here you see that I'm on uh, my Dev Insider build uh, 22.538 right now that's installed really well. And uh, one of the things that uh, we were looking at is the code information from that leak. So according to the leak, the uh, next version of Windows, which is Nickel, uh, will be, of course, 22H2. And it is stated in the build as 22H2 release. Now, what it says is that there are two specific dates. The first one is about the features. And that one states that the feature update uh, all the features need to be completed by February 4th. So that's, uh, you know, what, a week away from now, just a barely more than a week away from now. So that will be the first uh, step. Then there's a second date, and that's what says that it has to do with all the internal code components and, and, and you know, making sure that everything seems to be working fine in the code itself and that is for march 4th so a month later march the 4th is the second date that's written in there so that means as we'll go to march 4th completed and the next weeks after that i don't know how long but technically close after that it's technically going to be pushed to dev insiders so if you're in the dev channel that's what's going to happen. What are we going to have in features in there and how is it going to show up? Uh, so, and what's the build number? We don't have that information yet, but we know that probably that's where dev channel insider build will actually increase by a bigger amount, a huge amount. The build number will probably progress a lot and we'll have probably a lot of features to look at. So that would be in March, sometime in March, where Dev in Insiders are possibly going to get a build. That's going to be interesting. I mean, that uh, is showing us that there's a progression there and that they're going uh, pretty fast in trying to, you know, tweak and, and fix bugs and change things around. It's going to be interesting to see up to what point Microsoft listens to its users regarding the, the start menu, regarding, you know, the right clicks like in the the taskbar, um, the way things are functioning within the build itself and the Windows 11 itself, where a lot of people are wondering exactly, you know, where what's going to change and where it should change. Uh, we have also leak of a uh, little modification or kind of a new style task manager. Still not that much different from what we have now, but they kind of tweaked it a little more. It looks more like an app. So uh, these are all little things that are interesting to see uh, in there. There are things also that seem to be a little backwards, meaning they've removed some features or some things from the control panel to send it to the settings app. But because of a lot of people not being very happy, uh, it seems that there's a few little things that they've actually restored in the control panel. So uh, that's going to be interesting to see also how the the tweaks, what they've changed, what they've moved, what they kept, what they reverted back maybe to some older way of doing things. Uh, but uh, now we have a little more an idea of a timeline for Windows 11. So the two dates to remember right now is uh, features need to be completed by uh, February 4th and the code itself for all the, uh, the, the, the functioning of Windows and the uh, the code base needs to be also completed for March 4th, the month after that. So uh, soon, I would guess, 
Dev Insiders will have a build. And that should give us a lot more stuff to look at. And then between that, of course, we know that the uh, standard version of Windows 11 is going to have probably some of the uh, some features from here and there that's going to appear slowly uh, before the big, big feature update, which is still stated to be somewhere around October of uh, 2022. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.